This should be the last time it's open today, Polly. So, get out of here. Get out of here. No one loves you. You. How dare you. Get out of here. Get out of here, kitty. There's two paths. You can't go with either. I prefer going through both gazer bolts like that. Wait. I can't go back to that, so. This one's the one just to get leisurely time through. Yeah, take the path and get rid of those bloody, that's what I suggest. I got a cold, it's kind of hard to play. Maybe that should decide the joystick and jump. Okay, break those. Here's the thing that a lot of people know about you can jump, keep jumping, go up the ladders. Pretty much going over how to play for everyone. It's kind of sad. But that's how you do the grip grabs and shit like that. Then again, how do you speak English? I never dig it. What, what, what's the chances an alien speaks the same language as a human? Apparently, according to everyone, very high. Get out of the fucking sneaking bud stuff. Quicksand, I guess. Gold board. I cannot talk today. Gold bolt. I'm sorry, my mouth wants to say different words. When you got a lot of live on your mouth, it's very hard to speak. I think you know that. Which path should we take? Which path should I take? You know this one? You can get a lot of bolts this way. Don't go up near these, they explode when you hit them, so. They instruct you on how to get up. And after a while, they kind of expect you to know how to do it. Let's go over here. 
you gotta bring the prize back from the hoverboard races, and that is annoying. The hoverboard race is harder than the hard. The hard. This this race is pretty much the hardest part of the game. I hate the races. I never did like racing games. And if they make a game off of Ratchet that involves just hoverboarding, like they did with Jack and Daxter, I will freaking hate these games. There's only one more level to go to, I guess. And we're just gonna go there, we're just gonna stop off there, and get some weapons, and turn off the game. Because I don't really feel like doing anything right now, so... Well, it's fucking Sunday, come on. You don't ever want to do things on Sundays. You're not supposed to do things on Sundays, but nonetheless, you never want to. I feel like going outside and just enjoying myself today. I don't know why. I just don't want to do. It's nice out, probably. It's like this weather only comes for like a fourth of the year, and it's like summer break. Summer in general, but even if it wasn't a break for summer, it would still be my favorite season just because of the weather. I never did like cold weather. Winter suck. The bolts here. Because if I do it this way, I'll get some extra bolts before I turn it off, and then when I come back later today, slash tomorrow, all these bolts will be respawned, and yeah, it's good to be smart, you know? I got five minutes, so let's, let's get all that. I have to start any cutscenes they're trying to do here. I'm trying to go up that far. You better know how powerful the ammo is, how much it costs. Like, the... Devastator, it, the ammo costs like 20 bolts because it's so powerful. Whereas this one is only one hit with every bullet, so it's one bolt for every ammo. And this is the blaster. Mainly it's a pistol with rapid fire. The gun we actually need to advance, but nonetheless. And what it does, I shouldn't really do first person to show it, is it's, well, like a machine gun pretty much. Longest machine gun. Let's see. It's pretty powerful too, watch. I mean, it, it's weak with one shot, like, it can't kill nothing with one shot, but, watch this. That, that, that's gotta hurt, okay, that's just gotta hurt. I think a lot of work to pick these guns, too, but... This is actually that, one of those guns that was on the... This is actually one of the guns that... No, it wasn't. Well, I could have sworn it on the box art. It showed him holding this to devastator he holds. Yeah, on the back is a pyro cider and one he shows you himself using. Cause this gun, if you show the picture of him using like a pistol machine gun, that wouldn't really be exciting for any kids because A, they shouldn't know what a pistol slash machine gun is unless nowadays. And B, uh, well that's just a normal game, a gun that's in every game pretty much really for kids. And the pyro cider is probably much more entertaining for kids. I think it was really sad. As cool as that gun was, I mean, it was still weak. It still is weak, but as cool as it was, a lot of the guns from this game were remade in the other games as it goes. Like, they always made remakes like the Devastator and Blaster. Always had, like, a new gun that worked just like them in every game. But, uh, Pyrocider didn't get a remake until Size Matters, which was kind of stupid. So, yeah, I think you can shoot that thing. Maybe you can't. Yeah, like the blaster had the lancer in the next game, and then Devastator had one called the rocket sh sh the barrel or something like that. The bomb glove always gets remade, and what's their gun that always gets remade? The rhino, of course, always gets remade, and that's about it, really. There's some gun you got. There's always some gun you gotta remake every game, and I feel really bad for them remaking all these guns, but. Cause it's like, you can't create any new guns cause you're using space like the ones we've already used. Like the Suck Cannon, which is a shitty gun, gun in this game, wasn't remade until the third game cause they found it useless. And, but then some guy requested, like, it was a funny gun, we want it back, and with the upgrading it wasn't no fun. You had to use it. I'm looking for a save point for it. Did I just... Oh, I thought I was pressing the button. Pause, but I never noticed that. So I guess that's about enough. Thanks for watching, guys. Stop talking. Just go outside or something.
Thanks for watching.